Okay, hello everybody, welcome to game number 11 of the Vampires, and TV Advantage. Pupok Traders is the team, I wonder if it's uh, coached, not coached by Pupok. He's got, he's got tentacles, ooh. He got some block and a mighty blow. Three rerolls though. Octopus Fago! <laughs> he's, got, he's got an octopus Fago. Brilliant. And, uh, yeah. He might get a wizard, but who knows. Went with, uh, went with block on that guy, up to 14 players as well. Yeah, he's getting the wizard. He's getting the wizard, so that's interesting. Octopus Fago, that's a great name, isn't it? Well, oh, maybe that maybe he's friends with Pupok okay? here. Fourteen fourteen vamps is a few anyway, isn't it? Even if the mighty blow does some damage. I think I'm just going to kick and see what happens. And get the tentacles on less players. Uh, even though I can, even though I can gaze him, can't I? And uh, and I don't have a a movement busted guy to put on the LOS. Brilliant. IGL HF zeros on the LOS. Zeros blitzable block and block. And yeah, the SPP's off the pitch, right? It's a pretty good setup, isn't it? I probably would. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't want to get multiple players by the beast, even though I can gaze him. Hello. Pupok student. <laughs> no, he's, he's, I mean, Nurgle take a while, don't they? They've got to get blocked first and all the warriors, pretty much. Uh, I guess he could have gone Mighty Blow Claw on the Pestigo. But you, you're just desperate for, for some reliability with Nurgle, aren't you? So, And he's got, he's got a fair bit. They're not like a really bad Nurgle team. At least he's got some block. It's not like... They've got like when they start off, they're so bad with no block and two rerolls. He's got some block and three rerolls, so it's not like a ridiculously un lopsided matchup, um, like it could have been. <laughs> As it is, he's got two mighty blow, and he might just get lucky, might he? Loads of block. There you go, he's certainly getting lucky so far. As he opens with a kill. Stinkers is a racist term. I don't think it's really racist. Well... <laughs> Yeah, no, it, it minus AV is unkeepable. Minus edge and minus move can can go on the LOS, no problem. But uh, no, minus AV is dead. But I'm on 14 players anyway, so it's alright. It's just not good for the drive, is it? Keep him. Survives mighty blow, what a legend.
I feel like I want to be stupid here. Should I be stupid? Yeah. Of course I should be stupid. Okay, so now we've got a. Uh, you can go there in case I bloodlust. I don't know to be honest when there's probably a few more skills on the team. I reckon I reckon the players to get more skills on the team. Shit myself there, I wasn't expecting a buy. As it was a good one as well, that wasn't so good, was it? A bite a good throw, but never mind. These guys have got to uh Got to get punched, I'm afraid. I'll reroll the GFI. Made the pickup. Glorious. Not bad. Not a bad turn. Well done, done. That was a good one. The, the cheeky four plus was the was the big one because if that hadn't worked, I would have probably tried something else. But once I once I'd got the four plus gaze, I thought it was worth going for the three plus gaze because I could always blitz him as well after that. Doesn't show the GFI reroll. No, it doesn't, does it? As if he didn't bolt there. Uh, yeah, I re-rolled the GFI and then it just didn't show it. And then had dodge for the dodge. I'm surprised he didn't bolt him there. He's got a wizard. Six and all rats. Well, <laughs> FYAD. <laughs> it was brilliant, wasn't it? What a what a response that was. He's got. Oh, he hasn't got dodge. Shit. He does not have dodge. Didn't die though. Did not die. Yeah, the bolt. I, I think I would have bolted there. I wouldn't have been happy about it, obviously. But hey, well, the bolt might have been a one <laughs> after that GFR. Just gets the push, but he can. Uh, he can blitz here, can't he, to get a one D. I'm not going for the killer bombs, no. No. 
And maybe I would have done if I wasn't already five five zero. Like if I started a new one, I guess I'd do it for the funsies. But after starting quite well and doing like a real vampire team, I'm not going to switch it to a crazy one. Gets the pal, brilliant. Brilliant gets the five plus. Gets the AV break. Super. And gets a pretty good scatter. Hmm. So that this vampire there's an assist there, isn't there? He could 1D him. He could stand up and gaze him on a fucking sick. That seems stupid. He's here. He can. What can he do? He can gaze him to free him up. Who would then. He can stand up. Oh, and then he could go. It doesn't, it doesn't even help gazing him. Gaze him. He'd go there. Hmm. Oh, he could just stand up. He could just stand up and gaze. Yeah, okay. Now oh, then the gaze doesn't work. He stands up. He comes in there, then he... Well, then it's only a one dice, though. It's not easy. Five plus gears. Oh, got it! Sick! Sick five plus gears. Glorious. <laughs> oh man. What a what a dirty boy. Oh, I should have blitzed with him. as well. Do I blitz him? Oh, fucking cunting cunt of a fucking shithead fucking cunt cunt fucking He's cunt. got a big chain here, I think this is a bad thing. Cunt fucking beast. I don't want to accidentally fail there. I don't want to just... I just want to... One, two, three, four, five, six. Nah, fuck it. I'm just going to pick it up and run. Right, and then someone else can blitz. He could, like, one dice blitz. One, two, three, four, five. That'd be a really good one dice blitz as well. Or you could dodge GFI and then the failure state's much better. Okay. Oh, failure state's a stun, but never mind. Raid, raid, hello, more Plovac. I, I don't know why the notification didn't come up, but thanks. Uh, wow. We all know how this ends. Ah, yes, it came off. Thank you. <laughs> um, auto dodge in blocks. Separate from auto dodge in blocks. Uh, I don't know. I don't know, but I don't know what you mean. But um, yeah, maybe that do. But you don't like the red background. Should it be darker? Should it just be black? Um. 
thought the red was a good idea because it's like vampires, you know. That was my that was my thinking. It's vampires. So this looks a bit like blood. This one here that I found. So I'll uh, I'll change it. Well, I can change it now, can't I? Maybe after this turn, what's happening? I <laughs> know I'm lucky to help all the earths. Oh shit. Oh, is he gonna go for the beast blitz? Oh, reroll gun. Don't own reroll. Looks like he's gone for the beast blitz. Or just a beast base. No. That's pretty lame. Another stun is annoying, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six. I've, maybe I should have dodged with him last turn to get him on this side. Got a double GFI to hit now. On a one GFI and then hit with the other one. That was me. Yeah, that was better. Gets the pow. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Refuses to use his wizard. Just pows them. Every, pows and stuns them every time. <laughs> oh shit. Picks it up on the sideline with no reroll. <laughs> Wow. Wow, incredible. Incredible. Could run around, gaze the beast, gaze this guy, and then go one, two, three, dodge three plus, and then to surf. A one, two, three, GFI, GFI. That seems not very, not very good. Could just like play properly for a turn. He's got. I don't know how I keep the pressure on best. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Just block him. Blitz him. All these stuns make it very hard for me, doesn't it? One, two, three. GFI gaze. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. GFI gaze. And then four, three plus. No, four plus. It'd still be a four plus double GFI. Um, but I don't know how I can... Just play it safe, that's the problem. I guess this block is one way. Gaze him to get the other one out. <laughs> All right. It's not good. I seem to have no players. Only lost one. I guess the two stuns. Three stuns is what made it feel so bad. Yeah, it is a bit like that, isn't it, Tony? I mean, you can make a cage, but I guess maybe I can try and crack it next turn. Got two standing vamps. <laughs> right. Seeing as this turn isn't ex isn't as exciting as last turn, I'll 
try and change this picture to a darker one here. better. Is that better? Yeah, his beast is very smart, isn't it? He needs to fail. He needs to fail a beast a turn. Would have given me an, an in, wouldn't it? Good. Down to one reroll though, so he's still in. He's still in a bit of trouble, isn't he? He's got the ball, and I mean, he, he's always going to have the ball in strength three. But he's got the ball in strength three, and there's vampires about. <laughs> this looks a bit more vampire-y, I think, because it looks a bit more like blood. I do like having the. Uh... <laughs> It like that well. Gets the pal. There's a vampire here. Look, he got that pal, wasn't it? So he can kind of screen a bit. There's vampires everywhere. So he's uh, he's still in a pickle, I think. But it was a good pal for him. Otherwise, he couldn't have got that guy back as well. I'm all about the production value, you know that, Tony. It is the Nurgle drive, yeah. Oh, it powers me again. Ah! Doesn't follow though, so we could gaze the beast and the uh, and that guy, and then just run through with a throw. Another stun. He stands up first of all. I <laughs> could just dodge all the way around. How do I get there? One, two, three, GFI, gaze, and then one, two, three. No, then he's got to be in. So he's got a double GFI. One, two, three, double GFI, gaze, then one, two, three, GFI, GFI. That seems shit. Gazing him. Gaze him. One, two, three. GFI gaze him. And then one, two, three. <laughs> GFI gaze him. And then two plus to hit the ball with another one. This seems this seems like none of it's going to work. <laughs> this seems really dull. Right, just punch him. It's already that shit. Anyway. Gaze him. Gaze him. I mean, that, that seems alright, doesn't it? Do I even try and gaze him? I guess I do. That's a three three two dodges. Fail the first one. Maybe I should have just stood him up, eh? Maybe we should like blitzed him. Maybe we should have blitzed him, stood and then just stood him up. Yeah, I guess that's what I should have done. I was being a bit silly there. I should have, I should have blitzed him and then just got him up. 
getting vampires stood up was important, wasn't it? Trying to be a bit too fucking clever there, I think. I'm not succeeding. Yeah, I should I should just blitzed. One, two, three, four. Like gone there, and then he stood up and just gazed one or whatever, just so I had players standing. I'll do it next turn. Just make sure I stand the guys up. I guess at this point, just stopping him scoring. I'm still chasing the turnover, but I guess I've got to just try and stop him scoring now. Get back to a vertical base. Stupid beast would be really be nice ever, wouldn't it? It's really good that he's got to activate him as well, thanks to the gaze. <laughs> Imagine if the first loss is to fucking Nurgle of all teams. That'd be funny. Make a Discord random for me. <laughs> oh dear. One reroll left as well. And that's the thing, he's got one reroll, so I kind of wanted to put the pressure on a bit. But I guess I shouldn't have. I should have just tried to get back into the game. Why like can't I get four dice at him and can't knock him over and then he just fucking castles a guy? <sighs> annoying. Pretty annoying. Right, so just get back into it. Get back into the game. This is this is the plan for this turn. KO my own good throw. Oh, for fuck's sake. It's all going a bit peak tong, isn't it? It's all going a bit peak tong now. After such a promising start. And his absolute... His absolute... Re uh, what's it? Not reluctance? I don't know. Him just not using the wizard. Insi his absolute insistence of not using the wizard. Has paid off for him big time because it looks like he's going to score anyway. But he got pretty lucky, I think, powering, powering dodges twice. On a one dice and a two dice. It was a great non-reel on the Bloodless, wasn't it? Straight into double skulls. And that's the thing, I mean, I would say almost never ever re-roll Bloodless, to be honest. <laughs> might be mine, it went fairer. <laughs> but it was. I mean, to say he's on one reroll as well. He had some really good dice when he when he used his reroll and stuff. 
some crucial stuns. But yeah, maybe I maybe I maybe I overcommitted that other turn if I played it safer. Rather than good amount of thralls. There's enough, isn't there? Three, four out. I mean, it's <laughs> there's two out, and they're both based by the same fucking noble warrior. As long as I can get the vamps back next turn, there's a chance. Yeah, he had to do that before the GFI, didn't he? Or maybe not even make the GFI. Another one gone. I don't like this. I mean, well, I like it on a personal level, <laughs> but I think it's not a good idea to let me let me hit the ball on two dice. <laughs> Hopefully, you'll get punished for it. I and mean, you should have definitely blocked this one and not that one. This is stupid, but it's already done its job, hasn't it? I've got two vamps out of the play. I've got no thralls left. didn't he and uh, and hopefully we'll be punished <laughs> well that particular rotter was punished <laughs> by getting fucking dead so that's good one two three four no one two three four gaze one two three four gaze one two three four five six or lock and then gaze there and then one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. Maybe that's better. Use dodge. <sighs> Lucky dingo. <laughs> I got the fucking ball. How oh, do you like them fucking biscuits? Um, right. As for defending it, maybe I could punt it. No, I'm in one disturbing presence. Punt is pretty strong though. I do have the ball and a blodger. Okay, I've got the ball and a blodger. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he did. He did the wrong play there, didn't he? I think punching that guy. I mean, it, it's it's quite good sidelining him, but he had to not have this guy burst. Oh yeah, there's a bolt. Forgot about that. <laughs> Forgot about his wizard. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, it wasn't good being in, in the disturbing presence, was it? That was the killer. If I hadn't been in disturbing presence, I think I would have gone for it. He's got one reroll. I don't know. I think I think the punt was pretty good there. I think the punt was pretty good actually. What would the roll have been? A three plus minus two. So it'd have been a four seventy five percent to not punt it. Mm. Like a seventy five percent punt it was. Or it could have been a one in nine punt, but then it'd have been a lot shorter. Maybe he did. Maybe he's gonna bolt at the end of turn or something. But I mean obviously there's not gonna be no bolt next turn because now I can can protect the ball if I'm lucky. I mean, he does have two dice on the ball easily, doesn't he? That's the that's the bad thing. It was an easy two dice on the ball, but it is blodge. He's powered every other fucking time he's hit us, mind. <laughs> hey! Irrelevant block first to suck your re-roll away. Good lad. Classic. Classic blood ball. Classic blood ball. He does have a scoring threat, yeah. He's got this guy. What's annoying is even if you gaze them, they keep their uh, disturbing presence, don't they? Hmm. I like dodging here, gazing him. Running around, passing it to him. Who's blitzed free. So, the problem is, there not being many fucking thralls at all. Two, three, four, five, six. I don't like going for the three plus here, but um, I think I have to. Shit! Shit! I need to have my own scoring threat. But, um... I have to have a scoring threat. I just have to. Well, the plan wasn't to, to pass out of three disturbing presences, no. The plan... The plan was like to do this. Um, we can't get two diced. And then like pass it when he's not in disturbing presence. Like, you know, just run through. I could have been here. And then... Passing it. Which is pretty good. 
But now I don't want to fail one of these one in nines and lose the ball, do I? I could go to here to throw it. That's like a long bomb. I really don't want to do three plus three plus three, but I mean, it's, it's the payoff is just too big, isn't it? If I if I do it, that's the pro that's the problem. I just stand here, he two tees me and gets the ball probably. Fuck it. You only live twice. Shit. Oh, baby. <laughs> Get elf done. Glorious. <laughs> oh yeah, he could have bought. He might. He might bolt now. You only live twice because it's a movie, isn't it? You only live twice, and you and you actually only live once. So I like to say you only live twice. I don't know. It's just a thing that I did. It was after losing. It was after using the fucking uh, after using the reroll. It was fucking pretty scary though, wasn't it? Because I was committed to it. I probably should have just done the first dodge or whatever. Roll the one. <laughs> Get up there. Yes, that was the that was the great part about the pass was the, him being the uh, backup scoring threat. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, it would have been good if I'd gazed him, wouldn't it? So that I wouldn't have had to roll any dodges. That would have been... Now get he's just going to get surfed for his cunt. <laughs> Now he's going to get surfed. Um, <laughs> Three for, for that, for that gaze cunt. attempt. Yeah, I guess I should have just activated him, yeah. Yeah, I guess I should have activated him. But worked out alright, didn't it? Fuck, I don't think, I don't think you can fuck this one up, Johnny Five. <laughs> he can't reach him, he can't hit him. He can only uphill, uphill punch him. You can keep him removing players, I guess. I do have three reserves, though. Dub one on the Bloodlust would be a thing, yes. Yeah, because you can't actually pass if you um, if you haven't done the you can't you can't do the yeah I'm not punting did work out in the end yeah um, you can't actually do the pass if you're uh, if you fill bloodlust now I can do a pass here to him if I uh, if I bloodlust so this is all right. Good. Get up there. Feel the VI penis. I mean, it's not always good to force your opponent to make the rolls. It depends. If, if your roll is a 2 plus with a re-roll, and his roll is a 30% knockdown, it's uh, <laughs> it's better to do the roll yourself, isn't it? But I know what you mean. Yeah, it went fair. Yeah, I know what you mean. Right. So, 11 players still. 4, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Good. And he's, only, he's down to 10, because that rotter got smashed. So, and yes, that's a, that's a dodge for him now, isn't it? Brilliant. So, so every, all vampires will have dodge after this game. Glorious. And the wizard threat is gone. Ugh. No, it's, it's not. It, just, it depends on the odds, doesn't it? Rest of development, it's not, it's, it depends, it depends on the odds, like a lot of the time, if you've got the ball in a blodger, your opponent has to power you to get the ball, doesn't he? So, it is, there's a lot of value in just having the ball on a blodger, but, um, you know, sometimes, 
it's worth doing things, isn't it? <laughs> he did roll a one on the wizard, yeah. Yeah, I was very lucky. I was very lucky. Right, all these block thralls, oh no, one block thrall died, otherwise they'd been punching, punching McPunchersons from thralls. Um... Oh, Knight for Gore's on 13, so if he gets a touchdown, he's laughing. I don't really know what the what the plan is here. <laughs> I don't really know what the plan is. Some kind of dubious potato, I guess. This seems not the way. Oh god! If he gets a perfect defense, I'm screwed. So let's let's not do it. Oh, what am I doing? What am I even doing? <sighs> let's not activate the vampires and let him do something. So they can all block. The vampires can stand here and not activate. And then he can he can commit and then I can go the other way. And I'm protected against a blitz like this. He blitzes this guy still screen. So yeah. This is quite a good anti blitz setup, isn't it? Against the wide setup. Back a bit further. Okay. <laughs> Fuck you, eat a dick. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, he wants to be able to, if he fills the pickup though, he's got to be able to bite, hasn't he? So, probably is good to have him there. And it is good to block with block. Do I even make these punchy punchies? Or do I just go for the pickup? Fuck it, go for the pickup. You only live twice. Straightforward, fuck it. Pow. Get up there! Has that prick? <laughs> when I say prick, I mean the rotter that's named Orbit the Sick. I'm not calling Ancient Flame a prick. The guy that I've just cast is the one that I'm calling a prick. Just to be clear. Get fucked, you little cunt! <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> it's not excuses, it's fact. That is it. It's not. I don't. I really don't want to activate the vamps, do I? And he can't get that much pressure on here. If he pals, he's still got to dodge through to put Brent. Plus, I'm vampires. I don't give a shit if he bases me. I don't even want to blitz because I might eat my own, eat my own thrall. I think it's better to just stand here and then let him do things. Yeah, yeah, but you know what I mean. I do. I mean, I'm, I'm not making excuses. I'm not making excuses. That's literally when I say "fuck you, you prick." I'm talking about the guy who's being cast. Now, obviously, you know that's why it's great to see a war dancer dead, isn't it? It's brilliant. <laughs> I'm not worried about the beast particularly because I can gaze him, can't I? So he's a lot less good in this match than in a normal match. <laughs> no, I'm honestly, well, you know, obviously the the guys are, the fucking rotters are pricking it. You're trying to kill all the players on the opposing team. You're not trying to kill the the friendly chap behind the computer, are you? It's 
It's funny because I've played people. I've played people in tabletop, and some people have been quite quite shocked when I've been like, "I'm going to blitz this dickhead <laughs> and stuff." <laughs> yes, good fucking piece of shit killed them and stuff. They didn't. They didn't seem to like it, but there you go. Uh... <laughs> yeah, well, the fuck you eat a dick chat wasn't very friendly. No, he wasn't, was he? So he has committed a bit now, but he's he's all mansdus. He's got two less players. He did give us two MVPs, yeah. That's true. This is quite a good all man thing, isn't it? I guess I've gone too wide with the vamps because the other one can't affect the play now, can he? What I'd really like is to block him, then block him, and then surf him. That would be good, wouldn't it? But that's a bit of a piss take. need a guy in there, and there's just no one close enough. GFI. He could, he could GFI to there. And then another player, and then block him, and then block him, and then surf him. I can, it's do, it's actually doable. <laughs> but I've got to roll two plus to punch him each time. So... Seems a bit shit. Gears first is brilliant, isn't it? Means I can 2D him. Oh, I've still got this guy back here. That's that's handy. That's handy, a player I didn't know I had. <laughs> oh, glorious. I was a bit outnumbered there. It's fucking pushes. This is a glorious gaze if it works. Willfully sticking a guy on the beast. Oh, boo. Because it would have been a 2D for him and a walk away for him, wouldn't it? It's pretty good. Get a push. Yeah. And then get a cheeky one deer. Ah, foul appearance. Yeah, I played. I played four vamps with this team. Four vamps, three rerolls as well. I start with twelve players, which is something I normally don't do because normally I just start with eleven because you're probably gonna have journeyman, aren't you? And then deal with journeyman for a long time, and then when you can go up to more than you know, twelve, more than eleven, then it's good. Ah, oh, shit. I'd fail the dodge anyway, but. It would have been really good if he didn't have block, wouldn't it? I wasn't so happy about giving up the block against block. If it had been non-block, it had been a great block to have given up. As the way the dice were rolled. That's the thing, exactly, yeah, Arrested Development, you know. <laughs> if you down with two vamps, you're fucked, aren't you, basically? But yeah, I prefer four. I prefer four, absolutely.
You want to be playing a vampire team, not a hobgoblin team. <laughs> like the hypnotic gaze, isn't it? Nah, he re-rolls. I think he had to, really. Realistically. It's great, because he's got to be worried about me just scoring again, hasn't he? Oh, he would have powered the blodger. Would have powered the blodger. Oh. oh, that means that I can't hit his uh, his gaze, his gaze, his uh, his beast man very easily. It does mean that I can just punch his fucking beast. Fuck. <laughs> I should have one dice too. He could blitz. Get a blitz going. Yeah. So he can block. Knock the fuck out of him. <laughs> Glorious. Punch. Punchy, punchy, pushy, pushy. There's a lot of pushes in this game, but I mean, it's alright, isn't it? It's not the end of the world. And I can just stay where I am. I don't, I don't need to go forward, do I? I'm one up. So. He, I mean, it's not shameful, is it? He's trying to engage and trying to make things happen because he's losing 1 0. So. He's trying to make stuff happen, but it's. Uh... <laughs> if you're engaging with Armour 8, you're gonna. You know, get some guys knocked down sometimes, and then uh, it's not good. <laughs> Trying to not activate vampires if I don't have to. Herp, derp, base, base, base. This won't fail. I'm on the right. Burp, burp, burp. <laughs> Yeah, he did blow the wizard. That was it. That made it simple. But I mean, you know, the, the wizard might have made it nil-nil, at least. Yeah, he didn't. He did. It, 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 maybe he could have re-rolled. I mean, I think he could have used it earlier. I think he did well to defend without using the wizard. You know, once uh, once a vampire, <laughs> once a bludge vampire had the ball a couple of times. Um... Hello, Zug. Um, you know, I think I think he did well to, to get. A, I think he got got a bit lucky to get as far as he did without using the wizard. But yeah, managed to get engineer two dice for his. Uh... Oh, <laughs> well, with a push, he's engineered two dice for his mighty blow, hasn't he? Which is good. I did roll. I did roll nicely at the end of the half. Yeah, I was really lucky to get the score in the end. But then he he had rolled nicely to to recover from from like losing the ball anyway. So. Yeah, my early gazes. Yeah, <laughs> they were really good, weren't they? The early gazes were really good. Yeah, I can start re-rolling things now, can't I? Oh, block saves him. Super throw. Right. 
so now I could just um, I could just blitz him and then dodge him and have a screen one two three four five six have the ball screened off um, one, two, three, four, five, six. If with a GFI, I could, I could really be good because I could blitz over here. I don't, I don't hate that right now. Hmm. He can punch the mighty blow now. Oh, you prick. Hmm. Blitzing around here seems nice. I really don't want a GFI. Two, three, four, five, six, GFI. But the GFI is so good, isn't it? Like, it's just literally so good because it can blitz there and then it's all screened off completely. And it's just a definite win then. <laughs> now we're getting to a <laughs> the part where I can't do the GFI now, can I? So that's not good. I just literally can't do the GFI anymore. But it would have been really good to have done the GFI and then uh, been completely screened off. But um, after using that reroll, you can block him and then just come around. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. Maybe I do the GFI. Maybe I do the. Oh, do a handoff. Oh, that's a clever idea, isn't it? Handoff's a good idea, isn't it? You're clever. You're a clever dingo. He's out of foul appearance. Uh, disturbing presence. Getting... Getting help from chat there. <laughs> yeah, the problem was bloodlust because if moved by moving him first, it was riskier. Um, yeah, exactly, little bad because the the handoff would have been horrible because I'll lose the ball, don't? I? And it is the same. It is the same dice, but um, yeah, the problem with the handoff was if either play blood. But I was kind of fucked anyway. I don't think it was good to play safe then. So I think it was all right to do that. Yeah, I've still got two standing vampires, don't I? If I fill a handoff, I've still got two standing vampires. Um, and there's more tackle zones and everything. Whereas if I fill the GFI, I could die and the ball could be in no tackle zones. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty lucky to not roll a bloodlust. That's true. I want to hand it off back to him, though, because I want to get the, sc the score in him to level him. <laughs> That stun was brutal, wasn't it? He's He's got three players down, and I'm one player down, so I've got two player advantage. This guy's wasted on this guy. So, it was a bit of a dodgy turn, that, though. 
Yeah, I think I, I, it, it just wasn't easy to make it safe, though, at Wolfpark. That was the problem. It just wasn't that easy to make it safe. If, if I could have, you know, if I could have, uh, if I could have screened him, I think that was, uh, that was right. But maybe I shouldn't have moved this guy. Oh, no, he was the one who did the blitz. The guy who, him, who screened afterwards, I already, I did the blitz first. So that guy should, yeah, I should have abandoned. I should have moved back. He, the guy who was there and got cast. He should have, he should have come back and protected yeah yeah so that's exactly what I should have done yeah hundred percent Wolfbark spot on e good old gears doing a thing e e <laughs> glorious gears ah we all love a good gears right <laughs> um. <laughs> Wow. Well, that was pretty good, wasn't it? He can punch. I don't really have to, I don't care about bloodlust. Do you want to re-roll it? Re -roll. I really like the knockdown. Come on. Good lad. Glorious. You can go for the gaze. It's not, it's not just the four re-rolls. It's if I roll a double skull, isn't it? Um, oh, there's not a screen there anymore. All right, well, he can go there. <sighs> I guess he can't go there. He can go here. Having to bite here is pretty shit, isn't it? So... I think I'm just gonna go... I think I'm just not gonna activate him now, because I've got a thing here. Yeah, biting the good throw. What I wanted to do was gaze him so that he could have moved up, and then I could have moved the ball up, but... I could just punch him. I, I, I don't want to move the ball now, do I? Realistically. He might be able to get the beast in. But I think I just passed the turn now. Yeah, yeah I should have done that first. <laughs> Safe moves first. Didn't complete. Moved everybody else first. Um, yeah, there's no need to move him, is there? No. Yeah, if, if I got the gaze off there, it would have been alright, wouldn't it? Because then I could have... Uh, I don't think it would have made much difference. I like not trying to dodge there, because now this is a one isn't it? And if he... If he wants to get the beast in... No, he doesn't. That that gaze on the beast was devastating, wasn't it? It made him made him do a one D later, and then stopped him doing t stopped him two Ding the bump there. He could have powered the bludger, but he it would have only been a one D unless he activated the beast first, isn't it? That's the killer. Right, good. So now. Hmm. One, two, 
three, four, five, six. And then he can't reach. And he can't reach. So this is a good place to stand. So he wants to go there. Him. Oh, I went the wrong way. The fucking auto path made me hit from the wrong direction. Oh, it's all right. It's all right in the end. Oh, killed him. Good God Almighty! Good God Almighty! That killed him. He can bite him. <laughs> Failing to get the gates off is it's very frustrating, yeah. <laughs> um, right, he can go there, tag him for, for what it's worth. He can go over here. <laughs> Fuck off with your tentacles, don't give a shit. Right, go on one day and get up there. Super thrall. Right, good. Pretty nice turn that, wasn't it? Everything's really safe. <laughs> you can't strength plus the niggles you've killed an entire team. <laughs> Pretty much did the first <laughs> the first game was nearly done, wasn't it? That was incredible bashing this, isn't it? Incredible out bashing. You did I'm too new for you, yeah there was it there was one incredible vamp game where it was it was <laughs> it was about four turns. Um yeah, maybe more than four turns, five or six turns. I was already one nil up. And uh and then what happened was um he threw a pass potatoed, I uh, blitzed him with block, cast him, and oh then that happened. Is is that the clip rat and blood? Is that the clip? It was brilliant. And then that happened. <laughs> oh, brilliant. What a, what a result. It was four turns. It wasn't even five turns. There you go. Thank you, Rotten Blood. That's a good clip, isn't it? Yeah, what we want is a is a pass. Absolutely, absolutely, get a pass in here. Um, so the good, good vamp wants to go here. He wants to receive. The, oh, he's on fifteen. Oh, he's on fifteen. So I could hand off to him. Not at the moment. He'd have to get blitzed first. Might as well gaze him. No. Need to push him. Push him for the handoff. Uh, take the knockdown or push him for the handoff. Okay. Right. And then he hands off. And then he passes it back to him. Eat this fucker first. Right. 
And then he can pass to him. There you go, buddy. That's a level for you. And... That's good enough, isn't it? End the turn there. He can get punched by Mighty. Do I don't want to get punched by Mighty Blow. I want to foul him instead. The push was disturbing presence. I'm too new for you. Um, as you can see, this this Nurgle warrior is here and is disturbing presence. Goes three squares. So because I had to hand off first to be able to attempt the pass this turn, I had to I had to push um, to do that. There you go. There is no point standing up the thrall because he'll just get punched again by block. So, yeah, even if he's prone or if he was gazed, he still got you. He still have the disturbing presence whether he's gazed or prone or whatever. So yeah, that was it. I had to get him three away to do the to do the greedy handoff and everything. I really wanted to take the knockdown just to hurt him. So there you go. Yeah, sh shocking SP. I mean, this. I think this is an okay time. This SPP farm when you've got it completely locked down, and you're winning one nil. I think that's a fine SPP farm there. Yeah, that was the push. That was the push. Yeah, the gears can't stop disturbing presence, and yeah, being prone doesn't stop it. I mean, I could have cast him, but yeah, that was the push. Passing is pretty much showing contempt for for your opponent, or showing contempt for the game state. And obviously, the game state is such that um, that's what I wouldn't have gone for that. Can. Double GFI with him? Oh no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't do that. Wolf back. That's uh, there's a line I would not cross. I like getting him on a fourteen. Puts him close to a, puts him close to a, a like you know another a Kaz or a touchdown any levels. I'm I'm quite happy with him doing that. I don't want him to do any other role. Well, this isn't this isn't any roles to score, is it? Because the bloodlust doesn't matter. So I could do a, I could do a cheeky punch, but. Yeah, because I can't kill my guy, can I? Fuck it then. Let's let's go for a cheeky punch. Oh, there's there's a there's a good one to punch here. Oh. I was going to activate everyone, and then just activate everybody. No, I didn't even need the assisted. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Right, I punched him anyway. I, I would, <laughs> no, I wouldn't have doubled. He's, he's the natural one to score anyway, isn't he? Because he's got bludge. So the bludge one's the most likely to score anyway. So I'm fine not level, not taking a touchdown on him. Thralls. Zero, two. Ooh, we've got two SPP here. These thralls are rowdy, look at that. Two, 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 and five. Right. Rock hard today. And so was my cock. <laughs> so was my cock. Oh, it's class, isn't it? VGP, absolute classic. So he's on 16 and he's on 16. That's pretty good leveling two vamps this game. And he's a touchdown away. Show nice flashlights. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> oh yeah, remember trying to storm the van running squad? Yeah, that was, that was the worst. <laughs> I should think about about auto pathing a bit more sometimes. Yeah, he wasn't salty at all, was he? Despite getting banged on by vamps. Retour. And not a touchback. Incredible. 
I mean, he got out bashed to fuck, didn't he? The the well, no, he didn't. We made we made even bashings, but he he started on eleven, and uh, and I've got armor seven across the board and injured my own players, so um, he was effectively out bashed. Um, from what from what any right minded person would expect to happen, but. Um, <laughs> I'm not gonna throw out the old F Y. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I definitely got the better of the dice, but you know, I did get more blocks, didn't I? Because he was, he was like, he was trying to break my fist with his face, wasn't he, on defense? Because he didn't have any other options. Because he's just a fucking, just an Urgle team, isn't he? He hasn't got much option apart from just base up and hope, hope things go wrong for the vampires. Um, and obviously they didn't, so he got beaten up a bit. <laughs> no, I think he played. He played fine, apart from I thought he was a bit too greedy, hanging on to his wizard in the first half, but he got away with it. And apart from when he didn't. <laughs> but if I was him, I would have used like the the vamp. I would have used the wizard on like turn one after the vamp stole the ball. Um. But he didn't, he hung on to it. And, uh, which I thought was a little bit greedy. Not bad, just a bit greedy, wasn't it? And then, um. <laughs> That's wild. Alright, let's, let's not expose the, the good thrall. <laughs> I, uh, I wanted to do three dice splits, but now I want to go over here as well. All right, let's go over here. So I guess it's just a two dice split. Then. <laughs> Dickhead. <laughs> oh well, that's what I get. That's, that's what I get for trying to <laughs> trying to greed a knockdown. <laughs> oh, a gong foul. I would have loved a gong foul. Could have a gong sound effect and. <laughs> Every gun foul that's made. If you want to be part of Team Positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby. I could have just blitzed with block. Yeah, it would have made any difference. I was just going for a knockdown, wasn't I? So, but yeah, I guess I, could, I guess I could have just blocked with block. <laughs> yeah, I did. I did want to go up here to make it completely impossible for him. Is what is what was my original idea. But uh, yeah, gong on the soundboard for a gun foul. That'd be brilliant, wouldn't it? <laughs> Jim Blitz. <laughs> what would that be? Yes, I just wanted to foul. Really, that was my thing. I wanted, I wanted, to, I wanted to three dice him and foul him so he couldn't make a mighty blow hit. That was, that was my, um, that was all, that was all I was trying to do there. I was just trying to stop the mighty blow hit. Oh, a skull. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, super thrall. He's too good. <laughs> yeah, I guess it would. Anyone's free to take clips and and you know, there's there's the Discord has a has a thing for like highlights and stuff. Um, so if anyone wants to clip anything, it is another win of vamps, yeah. <laughs> Jimmy, but with a black eye. <laughs> Oh yeah, I'd take Adrian Thrall. Yeah, then you don't have to carry on a vamp all the time, do you? <laughs> <laughs> God, no, it, is. it fully is. Oh god, that's not even a joke. Look at that. Nearly the same AV breaks, but I mean, I, bro I broke my own armor as well. Not not a lot though. Didn't make didn't fail many 
I bet this is silly bloodlusts. It felt like silly ones. 85? Not that crazy. It felt like crazy bloodlusts. The gazer would be low average, I guess, because I, I did make some 5 plus, uh, 4 pluses, but dodges weren't great, but then they, oh, I'd made a lot of 3 pluses. GFIs were great. Um, pickups were great. Lightning Bolt was amazing. Catch was good. Pass were good. Brilliant, pretty good game, really. 24, 30, 18. So not, not great not great knockdown dice on, on totals. And... Uh, Oh, what's he got? 40, 36, 59. <laughs> so he got incredible block dice. <laughs> 40, 36, 59. That's a lot of blocks he made as well. 64 blocks he made. Wow. Um, and just... And he just got out bashed despite making all those blocks. So he's pretty unlucky. Pretty unlucky to not get more bashing done, wasn't he? He did make a he did make a few on dodge, I guess, yeah. And he didn't have block on a lot of his blocks, I guess. But um yeah, it's good, isn't it, having dodge on everybody and and people not having tackle. That's pretty good. That's pretty good when you've got dodge and they don't have tackle. Let's go dodge. And Knight for Gore. Uh has he already got dodge? Yeah, so you can get block. So now, three bludge vamps. The team looks way better. And, I don't know, wrestle. Wrestle, maybe. Maybe wrestle. Wrestle's pretty good with vamps. That vampires, isn't it, to, like, open things up. And 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So I can buy two more players. Um... And that's only 80, so I'm still, still doing all right. So I'll buy two more players. And it goes to 650 as well. Incredible. Right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.